Another look at the life of Tropical Cyclone Honor up to a few hours ago. Information uh, indicates that the uh, cyclone is a Cat 4 system on the Australian scale. Welcome to another update being brought to you by the Force 13 Australia Oceania team. And the satellite imagery is looking good for the uh, cyclone. And here's the current position from the Joint Typhoon Warning Center. The Joint Typhoon Warning Center in their current advisory remains uncertain read the track for this uh, particular cyclone. Uh, this has been their position for a couple of days now and it, it's located near 16 decimal 9 degrees south, 166 decimal 2 degrees east. Movement over the last six hours, 240 degrees, six knots. And it's based on the eye fixed by a satellite. Tropical Cyclone Holler is uh, around 1.30 nautical miles west northwest of Port Vila, Vanuatu. Has tracked west southwest at six knots over the last six hours, as just stated. It has a uh, five nautical mile eye. Animated uh, enhanced infrared satellite imagery depicts a compact system with a seven nautical mile pinhole eye. And wave height at this point in time is 18 feet. Here's the current uh, track chart from the Fiji Met Office. They have it as a Cat 4 and likely to be a Cat 5 system around 1800 hours local time Fiji which will make it about 1600 hours Australian Eastern uh, Standard Time. Now we have a look at the NOAA floaters. Uh, central pressure could be anywhere from 954 millibars up to 962 millibars. The Joy Typhoon Warning Center has finalized uh, their uh, position on Tropical Cyclone 11S uh, Dumasili. Apology for the pronunciation. Upper level divergence and we still have the VES 98P in the Gulf of Carpentaria region. Now here's a look at the wind shear and wind shear is not very healthy for the uh, cyclone especially to its south the 24 hour shear tendency, tropical systems love the area in blue and green. The red icon indicates the position of the uh, cyclone. A 50 millibar vorticity, you can clearly see the tropical cyclone, if that's 98p, and a low pressure system to the rest of the North Island, New Zealand. 
Now here's the latest information from the Vanuatu Met Office. They have it at 9.54, the same as the Bureau of Meteorology. A Cat 3, but I'm going for a Cat 4. A Cat 3 is probably the, uh, the other scale. And uh, they have it located around 195 kilometres west southwest west of Manakula, 280 kilometres west northwest of Ifat. In the past three hours, severe tropical cyclone was moving in a west southwest direction, 11 kilometres an hour, six knots. Sustained winds close to the centre, estimated at 150 kilometres an hour or 80 knots, and this is to deepen or strengthen. Damaging gale force winds, 75 kilometres an hour, expected to continue to affect Sama, Panama, and Tafia provinces across today. The Tropical Tidbits uh, website. Uh, here's a track from the GEPS and I'm actually favouring this one because uh, this one indicates close to New Mia. We know that the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre's track cone has the entire area in its uh, cone. And here's the HWRF model. The intensity scale is in the circles, bottom right hand corner of the screen, and the sea surface temperature is above the uh, circles, and sea surface temperature is a very healthy 30 to 31 degrees Celsius. We will continue to bring the latest uh, information uh, to you. And please monitor the AU channel. Total accumulated uh, rainfall. The rainfall scale is at the bottom of the screen. And what I look at is the area in yellow and dark brown. And you can actually see uh, the yellow along the entire western coastal region of uh, New Zealand. And again, it's the Gulf of Carpentaria right across the top end down into northwest WA. Now we look at pressure and wind. A caution needs to be applied when viewing non official weather sources. And are we going to see something uh, developing to the east of Bougainville Island, which is just to the east of? The Solomon Islands. Now, are we going to see something up there in the Timor Sea above Darwin? Now we look at the Himawari 8 satellite view for the Australian Eastern and Southwest Pacific regions. And you can see the low pressure system just to the north west tip of the North Island of New Zealand and here's a closer look at the tropical cyclone holler and it's likely to become a cat 5 you can follow system. Force 13's outlets the website force13.com which has had a revamp and is still under reconstruction but take a look also YouTube of course if you haven't subscribed that might be a good idea visit force 13 we're also on Facebook under the same name of course and you can like us on there and you can also follow us on Twitter search force 13 all in text for those you can also add force 13 on Skype or my personal account on discord full 13 at extension 9094 Oh.